Hello again, Dark on the Clock with more Make a Good Mega Man level contest 2! Next up, we are going to 49th place by Mini Macro, Maze of Significantly Less Death. The title is, of course, a reference to Flashman 85's Maze of Death in the first contest. Now then, this actually isn't really a maze so much, I don't feel. Maze of Significantly Less Death. Music Predestined Fate by Magnus Palson from uh, VVVVV. Pretty fun game. Your teammates are trapped around this weird area after a plane crash. Go save them. <laughs> I don't know how to plane crash into this weird building, but, uh... This is a, uh, Kind of long, but not too terribly difficult stage. However, it suffers from a, <laughs> a bit of bugginess. Maybe I'll show that off in some bonus content. Uh, some of the things that happened to me while I was playing around the uh, bug testing. One of the few stages where I actually had some significant <laughs> things happening. <laughs> so, on the whole, this is a okay stage. It kind of just is a little bit... a little bit overly uh, long for its own good. A bit overly long and a little bit uh, not totally on the interesting side. Essentially, on any of the given passages, you can already see this, not a whole lot happens. There's a couple of enemies scattered here and there, a couple of platforming quote-unquote challenges. There's really only a couple of parts that are actually any challenge. The rest is a little bit uh, kind of on the boring side. Renhoek. Uh, the people who were selected for this got to make their own quotes for what they are saying, so that's why... <laughs> that's why. <laughs> yes. I don't think anything more needs to be said there. <laughs> and I'm just gonna leave that M tank hanging around for now because I can get that later. E-Tank, though, I have space for that. Alright, I got to go a bunch of different ways, so... There are four more people to find, as you can see by the gates up there. Five gates, five people. This is kind of emblematic of the issue with the stage. This path is so uninteresting. You get your flipping for sure, but there's nothing really to it. It's just there to be kind of there. There's Gary. And then there's going back is, you know, no change, really. And I just clipped through the floor. <laughs> that wasn't something that happened to me last time.
for some reason I can't clip through this. Oh, that's never happened before either. I think something changed because initially I, uh, clip I was able to clip through and flip to the wrong way up to another screen. Now it's just a death pit. <laughs> I didn't clip through the floor. I don't know why that happened last time. And it's not like death is that big a deal. But still. There's a whole lot of what's going on. Well, let's use some weapons, why don't I? There's one right there. Got more flipping. And spikes that are meant to be a threat, but really aren't. Uh, that wouldn't have been a threat either, but I wanted that E-Tank. Yeah, this spot is like, if you don't give it water physics, maybe it's a little bit actually more kind of threatening, but with the water physics, nothing really... You kind of have to be trying to die. about the only, like, actual quote out of all of them. I didn't need those at all. What was I even doing? Also, teleporter back here. So, uh, I saw that spike. I just saw it just a moment, fraction of a second too late. Oi. Right. That's a kind of a rough one. this. Yeah, I see. If they're not timed uh, in sync, then you can make it so that you have enough uh, frames that Mega Man can just stand there. Here's Mr. Kyrum. this way. Yes, back to where we were once before. And I positioned myself completely wrong. Fortunately, there's a checkpoint right nearby. And I 
ahead and give these a go. Oh, happy day. That was not quite what I intended, but it worked. Sweetest too. And me. Okay, I'm curious. Can you actually use the M tank? No, you can't. Using an M tank while you were full up in Mega Man, one of the Mega Mans, uh, would make it so that you could. Uh, Turn every enemy into an extra life. That apparently doesn't happen here. I didn't think that would happen, because, uh... I mean, extra lives don't mean anything in this game. But I thought, they might put something in. Guess not. Alright. I think I'm echoing that sentiment here. It's just so not a lot, not a lot in the stage that you know, is all that interesting. Also, that's not flashback. In case anyone was thinking, maybe it was. Pretty sure Flashman is in tier 9, so we'll see in his level eventually. Maybe sometime in the middle of 2016, the way my pacing is going. level. Lots of, uh, some pretty darn low scores and some pretty darn high scores. Gary seems to be able to find something to complain about at a level he put at over 75%. Original fan character, Mega Man. Well, uh, as someone who is not a spreader, I don't blame them for just using green colors. Also, that kind of keeps with the VVVV. Yes, I encountered another one just while I was playing. <laughs> Completely by accident. Some of this has been fixed post-judging, but not all. I don't know that all of it could be fixed post-judging. I don't know that all of it could be fixed pre-judging, unless they kind of redid some sections. Alright. Well, what do you have to say? By the way, if you don't know who this is, uh, you haven't seen me play Mega Man Christmas Carol. Scrooge. Bah humbug. That goes the last of my change in that dratted City of War machine. I say it's rigged. City War? Hmm. There must be a reason why there's a name for it. 
Anyway, that's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.